राह में फिरता है आवारा दुखों से हरदम हारा बोला नहीं है दुनिया में अब कोई प्यारा लोग बोले देखो वो रहा बन जा रहा बन जा रहा बन जा रहा Now, what do stray pets have to do with capacitance? These abandoned pets are left to wander here and there, just like stray capacitance, which you will find lurking about in circuits. Saral shabdo me kahin to stray capacitance is like having invisible capacitors on a circuit. We are talking about stray capacitance. Let us first talk about what's a capacitor. Isko samajhne ke liye ek demo dena padega. So you have two parallel conducting plates. On one plate you have holes, and on the other you have electrons. Electrons, as you all know, are negatively charged subatomic particles, the lightest lepton. Holes, on the other hand, it is not a physical entity like electron. It's just the absence of electron at a particular position in an atom. So conventionally, holes are assigned an equal. and opposite charge as that of electron so next is the direction of electric field it's always directed from positive to negative charge so it will be directed towards the electrons from holes to electrons as you can see all the electric field lines are pointing in the same direction now this is a fully charged capacitor and let us say that initially the voltage the voltage across these two parallel conducting plates is 5 volts we now place a resistor and close the circuit now what happens is that capacitor will now act like a 5 volts battery it begins to discharge why because the current will flow since you have closed the circuit the electrons will now move towards the positively charged plate where the concentration of holes is more so as the electron leaves its initial position you will have an immediate presence of hole at that location and this first electron is now traveling with the maximum energy energy is q b since the potential difference initially is 5 volt the first electron will have the maximum energy and it will reach the opposite plate where its subsequent collection will lead to an absence of Hold. Now during this the voltage will subsequently decrease from 5 to 4 volts why because you see the orientation of electric field the orientation of electric field will now be anti parallel exactly anti parallel to the orientation that it was earlier so it will lead to a decrease in the electric field within the two plates and eventually a decrease in the voltage and charge across this capacitor now the next electron will move but with decreasing energy since the potential difference is now 4 volts only and its subsequent collection will again lead to an absence of hole and the electric field lines will again be oriented anti parallel which will result in decrease in electric field and charge and hence the ultimate collection of this second electron will lead to a potential difference of 3 volts now ab jo subsequent electrons honge they will move in the same way and their energy will successively decrease because the potential difference is continuously decreasing and the charge within the capacitor will also decrease until we reach a stage where this last electron will move with the minimum energy and its subsequent collection will lead to a fully discharged capacitor which is having zero charge and zero potential difference across its two plates so you all know that the direction of the conventional current will be opposite to the direction of the movement of electrons so this is shown in the figure and from this expression of discharging of capacitor wherein v not is the maximum potential difference initially it was 5 volts in this case and as the time increases this voltage will gradually decrease so this is the expression for the voltage the value of voltage at any time instant it is also to be noted that this is an exponential decay curve and it takes infinite time to reach to a zero potential difference so for a capacitor to get fully discharged infinite amount of time is required and this curve will asymptotically approach to zero now when the capacitor is fully discharged you will require a battery to charge it 5 volts battery to charge this a uh, capacitor to its maximum potential that was initially 5 volts so as you connect this fully discharged capacitor to the battery you will see the current from the battery will start to move which means that movement of electrons opposite to the direction of current will take place now as you can see as this happens 
the two plates of the capacitor will gradually acquire opposite charges one side you will be having holes and on the other side there will be electrons such that the electric field lines are again directed in the same direction and this capacitor has now been charged to its maximum potential and this is what we mean by charging of a capacitor and this is the expression and it again takes an infinite amount of time to fully charge the capacitor to its maximum potential. This was all about the charging or discharging of a capacitor. What at all do we mean by capacitance? It is the capacity to store charge. Now we were on stray capacitance. Stray capacitance is an unintentional unintentional manifestation of electronic charge in a circuit or non capacitive components isko samajhne ki koshish karte hain unintentional manifestation of electronic charge in non capacitive components kya matlab isko aap aise samajh sakte ho ki humne khud se nahi chaha tha lekin kisi wajah se halat aise ban gaye कि हम वो बन गए जो हम थे भी नहीं जैसे इंडक्टर कैपेसिटर बन जाए अब आप बोलोगे इंडक्टर क्या है तो बोथ इंडक्टर्स एंड कैपेसिटर्स आर एनर्जी स्टोरेज डिवाइसेस व्हिच मींस दैट यू कैन स्टोर एनर्जी इन देम तो आपने कैपेसिटर्स के केस में देखा आल्सो सिंस दीज डिवाइसेस कैन नॉट जनरेट एनर्जी दे कैन ओनली स्टोर देम सो दीज आर नोन एज पैसिव डिवाइसेस तो कैपेसिटर्स आपने देखा दे स्टोर एनर्जी इन इट्स इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड हाउ एवर इंडक्टर्स जो हैं दे स्टोर एनर्जी इन देयर मैग्नेटिक फील्ड सो वट हैपन्स इज दैट वेन एवर यू परचेज अ फ्रेश इंडक्टर फ्राम अ मैनुफैक्चर द लीड्स ऑफ द इंडक्टर आर यूजअली वेरी लॉन्ग दे कैन बी ऑफ सेवरल इंचज अब ये जो लीड्स हैं ये हैं तो एक तरह का कंडक्टर ही एंड वट हैपन्स इज दैट वेन यू विल मेक द कनेक्शन इफ दीज आर लॉन्ग इनफ एंड इफ देर इज अ पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस बिटवीन दिस एंड द अदर एडजस्टेंट कंडक्टर नियर बाय it will act like a stray capacitance it is to be noted that even a small inch of wire can have considerable amount of capacitance now capacitors and inductors they are alag alag entities and what happens is that capacitors favor change and inductors just don't like this so inductors ko change acha nahi lagta capacitors ko change acha lagta hai to iska kya matlab hai if we talk about low and high frequency signals to frequent change aapko kis mein dikhega हाई फ्रिक्वेंसी सिग्नल में एज कम्पेयर टू अ लो फ्रिक्वेंसी सिग्नल हाई फ्रिक्वेंसी में मोर ऑसिलेशन आर प्रोड्यूस लो में कम होती हैं तो वट हैपन्स इज दैट जो लो फ्रिक्वेंसी सिग्नल्स हैं दे गिव सफिशेंट अमाउंट ऑफ टाइम टू द कपैसिटर्स टू गेट फुली चार्ज तो जब वो कपैसिटर वंस इट गेट्स फुली चार्ज वट विल हैपन इट विल स्टॉप द फ्लो ऑफ करंट and it is because of this reason capacitors can be used to filter out low frequency signals so hota kya hai inductors allow low frequency signals but they impede rokte hain kisko high frequencies ko lekin capacitors low frequency signals ko rokte hain unko filter out karne mein help karte hain lekin high frequencies ke liye wo allow kar dete hain unhe jana so agar if at all because of this stray capacitance an inductor is now behaving as a capacitor to usko jo low frequency signal allow karna tha ab wo usko rok dega to capacitor ki jo property hai wo inductor mein aa gayi aur inductor ne apni property lose kar di to what will happen so this will cause a major problem in the case of transmissions and if the circuit is a radio or an audio circuit the entire range of frequencies may be now blocked and this will now cause poor transmission of certain frequencies jo frequencies allow kar deni chahiye thi wo block kar di hain because of the effect of stray capacitance to so stray capacitance ki wajah se tumhe ek dikkat aa sakti hai uska naam hai cross talks kya hoti hai demo dete hain hey how are you i'm fine what about, about you बेटा बदल जाओ वक्त के साथ या फिर वक्त मजबूरियों को मत कोसो हर हाल में कौन कहता है की आंसुओं में वजन नहीं होता एक भी छलक जाए तो मन हल्का हो जाता है so these mobile phones they work by sending and receiving low power radio signals much like a two way radio system so these signals are sent to and received from the antennas antennas kisko attached hai these antennas are attached to the radio transmitters and radio receivers 
और ये सब क्या कॉन्स्टिट्यूट करते हैं दे आर कॉमनली रेफर टू एज मोबाइल फोन बेस्ड stations and these base stations are linked to the mobile and fixed phone networks and their purpose is to pass the calls and signals on into those networks so ek tarah se your mobile phones need to have a site of these base stations matlab inke beech mein is tarah ke kuch obstacles nahi honi chahiye jiske karan jo ki radio waves ye transmit ho rahi hain wo kahin interruption ke karan theek tarah frequencies wahan pahunch na paaye base stations have to be located in the areas in the areas jahan pe hills trees ya tall buildings is tarah ki cheezon ke karan kuch obstacles na create ho aur maximum area cover ho sake iska maqsad yahi hai ki jo radio signals hain jo aapke phone se us base station tak ja rahe hain wo uninterrupted ho so as to maximize the coverage available so as the number of mobile phone and broadband users increase the pressure is now on the mobile network operators so the problem of crosstalks reduces to this there are too many mobile phones and not enough frequencies and the result is people are talking over one another This means that literally there are hundreds to thousands of people who are using the same system. You are having a conversation, you can hear it and it's most likely that thousands of others can hear it too. It's not completely private. So, we were on stray capacitance. Is there any solution to this? We were talking about inductors. Inductors have long leads. Now, if you can somehow trim these leads, the solution can be there. We have surface mount inductors. They have no leads. only terminals so they are placed directly on the power plane of the circuit and being leadless they will stop all the capacitance so this thing will enable them to act real inductor inductor hi rahe capacitor na bane so it will now allow low frequency signals as it used to do earlier so we were on stray capacitance we talked about non capacitive components now what is this unintentional manifestation of electric charge in a circuit इसको ऐसे समझते हैं ऐसा क्यों हो रहा है कि जहां वो है भी नहीं फिर भी ऐसा लगता है वो वही है मतलब कैपेसिटेंस जिस जगह आ रही है वहां दरअसल हमने कोई कैपेसिटर लगाया ही नहीं था तो दिस इज व्हाट वी मीन बाय स्ट्रे कैपेसिटेंस सो मच लाइक स्ट्रे डॉग्स और कैट्स स्ट्रे कैपेसिटेंस हैपेंस टू बी वेयर इट इज बिकॉज ऑफ द सर्कमस्टांसेस इट्स वेरी इजी फॉर स्ट्रे कैपेसिटेंस टू अपीयर इन अ सर्किट ऑल यू नीड इज टू कंडक्टिंग एलिमेंट्स व्हिच आर at different potentials maintain at different potentials and they are very close nearby such that there is an electric field between them electric field can be generated between the two it will act like an imaginary capacitor even if we didn't do that intentionally but there can be something within the circuit which acts in this way so what can they be as already discussed they can be the leads of transistors diodes and inductors so if you have a printed circuit board for two closely packed conductors there will always be some sort of stray capacitance acting between them you may also find the stray capacitance in any of the conductor with respect to the ground since there will always be a potential difference between them so it's always a good idea to minimize or reduce this stray capacitance and how can you do this we talked about surface mount inductors next can be you know the uh, formula for the capacitor it's epsilon a by d epsilon is permittivity of free space a is the area of overlap of the plates of the conductor and d is the distance between them so maybe placing the components far apart can reduce this capacitance so try doing this it will minimize your stray capacitance let's wind up this video with a message from my end please to show some love for this stray animals they need your support help them in whatever way possible and unlike humans they will remember and respect you for this in return 